Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So this time we don't have a huge farm contraption. I was just messing around a little bit of those skulk charges and was wondering if it's possible to make a bi-directional skulk line. So here we got a yeah, skulk circuit where the charge goes around clockwise in a circle. So the way it works is you have a charge enters the skulk block here. It can't go back to the left because the trapdoor is blocking it. There's a full side um, yeah, blocking the charge, but it can go to the right because there's not a full block. But that's how the system works. Right, so I came up with um, four different systems to reverse the direction. So the first one to show is using doors. So here you can see if we kill a mob on top of the skulk block, it could go to the right or left and into the skulk block, but it can't go back because the doors are opened or closed. I'm not even sure what to call this. Anyway, so yeah, charge would go to the right. Oh, I forgot a button there. Unfortunate. And yeah, if we depower all of those torches, we could reverse the direction again. Okay, so that's pretty convenient. Uh, you have to use doors here because the trap doors wouldn't open uh, the same way. But you can also use trap doors if you would go up vertically. So here, I made a little system. It's already basically the circle. Uh, maybe just reverse the direction. Okay, um, let's get another chicken. No, I think it's probably better to use a brute. It drop up with over 20 XP. Okay, so currently the charge is held up here. You can send it this way. And by just changing direction of the trapdoors, you can also send the charge back into this block. Okay, then next thing I want to see if I could go in a straight line. And that's definitely possible, but it's a bit hard to see. It's probably better if I show this with the vertical line first. Uh, you actually need to use stairs. And, well, in order to basically change direction of the stairs, you just need to push in different set of stairs. So that's the idea here. Uh, if you look at this, here the charge can go up and then left. Go through this way. And here with those stairs, it can only go down. You can go right, down, left, and so on. And you can just combine both directions if you just switch out uh, the type of stairs you're using. All right, so let's check it, check it out here. So the charge goes to this block here. And if you push in the other set of stairs, it would go back up. I'm just placing honey blocks here on the side so it uh, couldn't spread sideways. Okay, and I also got the horizontal version here. I think you need to, to change it up so the charge can go this way. And by pushing in the other set of stairs, yeah, it can go the other way as well. All right, and yeah, with all of this, so not too hard at this point to make a yeah, circuit where we can change direction. So now it's going clockwise. I flick the lever, just change the direction of the trapdoors. It would go counterclockwise. So currently, there's not really a use for this, but we might see more skulk charge mechanics soon, and this might even be useful for some kinds of contraptions. But at the moment, I think this could be a nice decorative element. If you maybe hide the other blocks a little bit better in the redstone, this could look pretty neat. So far, I'm really loving the skulk block mechanics, and I'm really looking forward to what else we can do with it in the future. Thanks guys for watching, and see you next time. Bye bye!